Hello, party people. Someone just honked at me in the parking lot. Like, do you not know the rules of the road? I hate when people honk at me. I didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> anyway, only happy thoughts from now on out because I am at Home Goods. I figured today we would go on a little shopping extravaganza to our trifecta. Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, always good things in store, right? What are we gonna find? Christmas clearance. Valentine's Day stuff. I was shopping before Christmas and found Valentine's Day stuff already out. So I'm hoping we can find a little bit of Valentine's Day decor. So let's hop inside and check things out. Maybe some clothes. <gasps> Maybe I'll get some clothes today. I don't know. We'll see. I do want to go thrifting. Not today. Another day. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Someone's staring at me. That's life. <laughs> Looks like they're bringing out all their spring stuff already. Happy New Year, by the way. I am ready for it. Look at this gorgeous stuff. That picture right there. Oh my word, this peacock platter. <gasps> Look how stinking cute. Is it a Lazy Susan? No, it's just a tray. These bird houses are darling. Oh my gosh, they look cuter than my house. Look at this bird mansion and this one back here okay this is not valentine's day but i figured you guys would want to see that look at that planter right there are you kidding me okay i wasn't gonna come down this aisle but what i have to show you this it's amazing guess that price of 30 dollars steal something like this plant is really pretty too it's 25 bucks oh and then that planter i need smaller ones I have a bunch of succulents by my uh, kitchen window and I feel like I need to elevate them. Look at all of these pots. Ooh, I'm loving the springtime colors. Here's some Valentine's Day platters and mugs. This platter's really cute. I'm gonna guess 13 bucks. Ayy. It does have a nice heart on the bottom right corner. And then the mug, You're My Lobster. Love that show. Wait a second, I feel like this is a steal. $25 for this plant. That's a pretty decent size for 25 bucks. Ooh, I want it. Where am I gonna put it? Ooh. Oh my word, look at these darling pictures. And then this one, hand-painted. Look at those bees. So cute. And then this little guy. I don't know what I would do with that. This is definitely for a special buyer. Oh my gosh, the flamingos in the background. Look at this cuteness. I found some random sprinkles over here. If you're gonna decorate uh, maybe some Valentine's Day cookies. I found some really cute kitchen towels and then like oven mitts down here, Valentine's Day style and Galentine's Day style, like the different prints. And then up here, like don't kiss and tell, <laughs> cute. The hearts, the lovebirds, <gasps> be you. Ooh, I like that one. I love the rainbows on it. And then hold up, look at this. Love, ooh, I feel it. Ooh, and then blue hearts. I'm digging that. Different colors, I like the blue. And then this is more traditional style. It's over here. Oh, okay, dogs. Oh wait, I didn't highlight this one over here. These are really cute and they are $7 for a pair of two. Most of them are $7 anyway. I haven't looked at every single price tag. Also found this heart-shaped dish for seven bucks. I have been looking into getting more like a nine by 13 dishes. Found this heart dish. This is red, six dollars. Ooh, a pink one over here too. This one looks more rustic. That's cute, six dollars. I mean, you can decorate your house with this. I don't think you necessarily have to bake with it. Ooh, look, a pie dish. Some more cute stuff over here. Is everything red Valentine's Day these days? Just leftover Christmas trays, maybe. Uh, what else did I see? Oh, oh, here we go. Hope coasters, nice. I feel like the air conditioner is like directly over top me. I found these, love and XOXO. They're Ray Dunn. This is their Ray Dunn section over here. $13 for those. Oh, this is more my style. Hot Mess Express. Got wifey. Cup of tea. Ooh, rise and shine. These are so cute. Cup of sunshine. Love that. Namaste. <gasps> Cup of happy. 
Oh, those are all sweet. Their Tupperware section looks pretty well stocked right now. It is the new year, so that means maybe you're meal prepping a little bit more. And they always have these sets of containers, 24 of them. I think they're cheaper than on Amazon, $8. Deal. Screaming deal. You know what else I see? This is a Pyrex dish or, you know, the fake brand. $4 for this. It's glass and it has a lid. What? And the quote of the day brought to you by Coco Chanel. If you dive this deep into decorating for Valentine's Day, they have bulletin boards, Valentine's Day themed, which are pretty cute. I have made it to the Christmas clearance. A lot of uh, treats, a lot of cotton candy and that kind of thing. But I wonder if she gets rights to this. <laughs> they have Valentine's Day candy. Didn't know this was a thing. What does it smell like? Did I just say candy? I meant candles. I wonder if it smells like candy. True love right there. Does this smell like true love? Nope, smells like flowers. And then I found this guy over here. Florida? <laughs> yes. Okay, I didn't know this was a thing. Valentine's Day pillows and blankets. <laughs> nice, I'm behind on this trend. First of all, those bulldog bookends. That's amazing. Also found this Valentine's Day theme. Okay, so apparently this is the Valentine's Day end cap. Like, are we too late already? Did we miss it all? What's... <laughs> Hopefully they're just putting it out, right? So all of these signs, they're galvanized. I think last year they just had white, red, and pink. Uh, looks like they have a darker pink and it comes in a set. That's pretty cute. Ray Dunn style, don't know the cost. 13 bucks, like everything else in this store. They also have a set of 10 Valentine's Day activity cards with highlighters. Ooh, worth it. And then they have a plethora of Valentine's Day cards. Ooh, no boys. Oh, no bones about Valentine? What? No bones about... This is over my head. No bones about it. Valentine, you're great. Okay. Oh, and then they have a set that looks like this. That's really cute. Guess that. $13. I like you a lot. Not as much as wine, but a lot. Cool, cool. Drink water, guys. Purifies the soul. Why is everything always about wine or coffee? Mama needs coffee and all you need is love and wine. Love. Ooh, I like the rainbow. I mean, I guess people love wine and coffee. Oh my gosh, so much so that they consider it their Valentine. Is this a candle? <gasps> DW. DW makes the best candles. That does not smell like coffee. Ooh, I don't know how they do it. I smell the champagne in there, like the bubbles. How did they do that? Dozen roses, I'm smelling it. I would say that smells better than a dozen roses. Mmm, that smells very sweet. Well, I'll just be here for 20 minutes smelling all of the candles. Ugh, pass on that one. Also more candles down here. If I had to pick one, I would pick my dry shampoo because that's what I smell right now, it smells great. Also, my hair tie fell out, had to use my daughter's scrunchie, that's all I had. This is a good one going into the new year. <laughs> okay, so I guess Home Goods put all of their best selling seasonal items right up at the checkout. Uh, I think we saw all of these candles start with yes. Yeah, it's good. Good motivation right there. Some more candles, a mailbox, that's cute. What are these? Love and cupcakes? Is that a cupcake? Hmm. Nope, they're decorative hearts. Well, you got me. Is this edible? A marshmallow pop? Three dollars, Lord Almighty. All right, some mugs, some more candles, great. Although this is a cute little set. It has a couple of candles in there and then, oh my gosh, a car air freshener. Okay, I would buy this just for the car air freshener, 10 bucks. Another little end cap up here. Again, candles, mugs, but they do have a cute little pillow right there. I like this, looks like my grandma made it. Also, this wooden heart, love it, seven bucks. What else do you see? Anything new? Cool, that's pretty cute. Goodbye, Home Goods. I did get a couple of items, mostly for meal prep, uh, but they didn't have a lot in the way of like Valentine's Day stuff, but I think TJ Maxx is gonna be where it's at. Oh, I got cringe all over my body. My nail like scratched my car. Oh. It took my breath away. It's like nails on a chalkboard. Oh, let's go to TJ Maxx. We're now at TJ Maxx. I feel like they normally have, thank you. Ooh, didn't think they were gonna stop. They normally have more. Well, I don't, fingers crossed. We're gonna see when we get inside, right? 
Well, I've already wasted about five minutes looking at the workout clothes. I'm hoping in the new year that I will be able to work out a little bit more than 2020. We're gonna, hopefully the gym nursery opens up. Look at these dumbbells that they have or kettlebells. And then I saw some scales down there. Oh my gosh, funny story about scales. And then I see all these yoga mats and they have red stickers. It looks like they're on clearance. 10 bucks for a yoga mat. Oh, you guys. A stabilizing grip. This is an amazing price for this type of yoga mat. $8 for this one. You guys, easily at Target, these would be in the 20s. $6 for this one. Come on. I mean, get one for all your kids. You know what I mean? Seven bucks for that one. And then I see all the workout pants. Ooh, oh, hey, I'm in the mirror. Guys, look at the clearance items down here. <gasps> I'm gonna be in here for a while. Actually, I can't be in here that long. That's cute. This stuff looks springy to me. Maybe it's from last season and so it's like not in style anymore. I don't know, that's really cute, right? So regarding the scale, in one of the mom groups I was in, uh, someone, I mean, they were all talking about, you know, what they got for Christmas as moms. And someone was like, well, I got a scale. So there's that. <laughs> this is so cute. Couple trends I've noticed, baby doll tops, extreme ruching, and Barbie doll clothing. I mean, 90s crop tops. Couple Valentine's Day clothing items, the XO with the pocket, that's really cute. I like this, ooh, that's the back. Go, a nice lace black top, ugh. See what I mean about the ruching? I feel like I see it everywhere. This tank top down here though, that's really cute. Ooh, ooh, the cold shoulder again. Is that in? I think I have fallen in love with this jute yoga mat. What? I love it. I have a yoga mat, so I don't want to buy it, but I do want to buy it, you know? Ooh, be mine. There you go, cute. And the big go-to gift for Valentine's Day, a scent. This is where I initially saw Valentine's Day stuff. So bath, heart, fizzers. These, um, what are these? Ooh. Wait, why does it come with a pencil? Oh, so you can write a little love note? All right, that's soap. Ooh, even more soap. More scented soap. Ooh, you're one in a melon. And even Ray Dunn sells soap. Their cosmetic clearance is always popping. They always have a lot to offer over here. Oh my word, look at that pajama set. Does it come with a robe too? <gasps> Stop it right now. All for the low, low price of $20. That's more my style. <laughs> Man, Ray Dunn is really taking over, huh? This is $17 for this sweatshirt. It looks really comfortable. What's behind it? Oh, a locust, nice. Cute. Okay, this is what we came for. Some nice looking Valentine's Day decor. Love you more. I see a unicorn on a box. Cute. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, a nice little uh, jewelry dish. Just kidding. It's a cake stand. <laughs> Again, is that price? $12.99, just like everything else in the store. Ooh, okay. Again, Ray Dunn is everywhere. They have garland. They have this nice little cookie cutter and spatula. That's nice. Mine just broke because I don't know my own strength. Oh, love you a bunch. All right, what else is over here? Oh, jewelry dishes. I'm just kidding. I have no idea. What do you eat? Cupcakes out of these? A set of bowls. Okay, use them for whatever you want. I love mom. That's fantastic. Me too. Oh, look, a gnome. I love what? Oh, a love like gnome other. And, and the gnome is actually a notepad all in itself. That's cute cute little box down here. How much is this little box? Ooh, $7. Made with love. Oh my gosh, look at this baby spatula. That is adorable. And then that love sign with the confetti back there. Some frames. Ooh, be kind. Did you see that bee? Here, I'll show you. So cute, but also cuter. Oh my word, does anyone remove re remember the movie Ever After? It's a good one. Uh, love sign down here. This is interesting. Oh, it's a photo holder. $8 for that one. That's really cute. I like this. These are $5. You can just imagine some waffles on there. That's what I put on mine. I like that one too. Ooh, another little bowl. Teaching is a work of heart. You can. Ooh, good words of affirmation right here. Hello. Hi. You've got all the right moves. Let's see. That was not the song I was expecting. Huh, interesting. So he had a rave with sunglasses on? 
All right. If you're wondering, he's still going. <laughs> well, all right, that's enough. Okay, some more knickknacks down here. Oh, did someone leave their list? That's from Christmas, cute. This is a different kind of frame, I like that. Nice little bowl again. They always crowd so much stuff into one area. I think I got that last year. Mine might be purple, I don't know. Peace, love, joy. Is this left over from Christmas? <laughs> I think so. Oh, you're my main squeeze. Love you to the moon and back, that's popular. Ooh, a red wreath. Wait, is that Christmas clearance? Yes. Even more Valentine's Day stuff on this side. I saw that bright pink candle. I'm definitely gonna sniff that. Oh gosh, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm stuck. <laughs> I'm like really stuck. <laughs> Ooh, okay, I see this everywhere. I'm liking it. Oh, that love sign is very sweet as well. Nurse life. Ooh, look at this one. Love, 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 crazy love. Is that a song? I'm pretty sure it is. I'd sing it for you, but I know how you guys feel about that. Yeah, give me love, love, love. I'm just kidding. Uh, what I wanted to mention was this gnome leg. How did I miss this? Look at those legs. I wish I would have bought the gnome. Also wish I would have bought the B mine. The black and white. Oh, take me back to TJ Maxx. Oh, let's sniff. Doesn't smell like anything. Some more cute frames. Oh, I like this. That's pretty. I love the purple. Okay, what have we not looked at? A love frame right there. Snoopy over here. Oh my word, you people. Be mine. I'm in love. I almost broke that. It's Christmas anyway. Let's put it over here. Love. Mm, the first Valentine's Day gnome I've seen. I saw more last time I was here before Christmas. Isn't that ironic? Ooh. Nice little heart wreath. Oh, and then there's a turtle. What does he say? Oh, just kidding. He's an iguana. Oh my, iguana, iguana dance with somebody. Yeah, I wanna dance with somebody. <laughs> yes, okay, that makes sense. Iguana feel the heat with somebody. I love him. <laughs> so now I'm thinking, was there some kind of pun with this one? You've got all the right moves. I don't think so. This one doesn't make sense to me. I don't know. <gasps> they have uh, some nice spring tablecloths. I mean, runners. All right, they've got all the comfy stuff out. I'm feeling this vibe, but also these Valentine's Day, these heart-shaped pillows, $30 and you get three of them. Ooh, my daughter would think that's very aesthetic. I love the black and white. Uh, nurse stuff over here, teacher stuff I see, something about wine. Oh, those are sweet. Best grandma ever, best mom ever. Do you guys get gifts for anyone other than your significant other? I'm the worst, I don't. Maybe our kids, we get them like some chocolate. Let's stay home. They have a lot of these. I know these are popular too. Our happy place, cute. Digging deep for this Valentine's Day stuff down here, guys. So cute, these like, um, you can put leftovers in them or food to microwave in. I don't know what they're called. They all have hearts on them, except for this one. London themed, like it, $4. Those are larger back there. I love that print, so cute. Also, Rascal Flats is playing on the radio. Oh my gosh, love them so much. I love these planters right here, or these pots, whatever they're called, $8, and then the large one is $10. I love them. Also, these would be great. This is what I'm looking for, to get my succulents off the ground. If you want a sweater that says masks and valentines, here it is. Uh, I also see this one out of the corner of my eye, $20, says live. Look you guys, I finally found Florida boots. It's amazing. <laughs> I randomly found this candle. You guys know how I feel about wild honey scent. It's only $10. I want to get it, but also I don't need another candle. It smells so good. Why do they put all the good stuff at the checkout? Look. All of that, all these hand soaps I don't have time to smell. That wooden decor piece, that's cute. The Be Mine, <gasps> I like that. Oh, all of these kitchen towels, all of these pieces right here. More candles to sniff, oop. Oh, that's sweet, always Be Mine. No time, no time. And some more pillows. I think they just want you to impulse buy. It totally worked on me. I just grabbed some kitchen towels. 
Oh, look, and then kids' books. Oh, that's sweet. Valentine's Day themed, and they still have Christmas stuff, of course. They also have a lot of Valentine's Day mugs right up here, too. I don't know, if you're into mugs and stuff, some of them are really cute. Oh, like this one. Our love is written in the stars. Love that. Also, check that out. Life-size uh, Valentine's Day card. <laughs> Another successful trip to the Max. Maxinista. Is that still their, like, tagline? Whatever. Would I call that a successful trip? I don't know. Do you guys want to see what I got? It's a bunch of random stuff. Okay, now we're going to head to Marshall's. Just walked in. Uh, Marshall's is popping. Also, these t-shirts, uh, $13 is a little steep. I mean, for me, only because I plan on thrifting soon. Let's wait to look at the clothes. Ooh, hold up, I found some clearance. That's a cute shirt. Also, um, I don't think this is clearance, but look how stinking cute that is. Adorable. Look at these hand soaps. I didn't even see these during the season, but they smell extraordinary. They're still $5.50 on clearance and then i saw this cotton blossom down here i don't know you guys are my is my kids bathroom fancy enough to have that Ooh, sun clearance sure is well this is how we do in florida that bathing suit is so cute if it had enough fabric to cover my bum i would totally get it all those hats too. wait red tags are they on clearance sure are and now i have head lice but look how cute this is it's ten dollars what ready for the beach all that artwork, I see a lot of clearance tags, but this is what we came for. See anything new? Hmm. I see some pillows. Oh my word. Look how cute that one is. Ooh, I see a doormat back there. Ooh, that might be mine. It is $10. See, the problem with this is I will leave it for four years. So do I want a heart style welcome mat for the rest of my life? Nah. It's only $10 though, and I think it's super cute. Oh, look at this pillow. I think we saw it before. Ooh, okay, guess that. Ooh, $17 for a pillow. This one again. Oh my gosh, I love it. <gasps> That's so funny. Love you long time. And then the XO behind it. These are $7. Oh, and then these metal brackets are uh, picture holders. Love that. Oh, yes. We've got some wooden signs. XO, love, love you more with the red truck. I definitely don't love that red truck more than anyone else. Hugs and kisses. I like this one. Okay, another wreath. What's behind me? Oh my, table runners. Beautiful. Really like those. Ooh, we've got some baking stuff over here. The bake shop, you guys, Be Mine is everywhere. Am I just noticing it because of Meredith's Bee birthday party? Okay, we've got some napkins. Ooh, we have some string lights. Hey, getting real festive this year. Okay, oh my word, the Be Mine spatula back there. <gasps> the little baby bee. Oh, I might have to get this one, $4. I don't need it, but it's so cute. All right, more spatulas down there. And some more, what are these called? Kitchen towels. I've completely abandoned my cart at this point, but it's empty, so I think it's okay. Someone might take it. Ooh, I like that little oven mitt right there. That's one of my favorite kitchen towel sets. Cute, cute, cute. Ooh, Marshalls is the jackpot. Okay, so good, better, best. Home Goods TJ Maxx Marshalls seems to be the best here. Maybe they have some meal prep containers because that's also what I'm looking for. Uh, or maybe they just have everything in one spot and that's what makes the difference. I love you to the moon and back. This one is seriously my favorite. Love you long time. All right, let's take a sniff of this one. If it smells like candy hearts, it's gonna be a no for me, dog. Yeah, it smells better. It smells better than candy hearts. Still not gonna get it. Boy tears? Oh, that's hilarious. Eight dollars, you can get some boy tears. Doesn't smell that good, but it's funny. <laughs> is eight dollars worth the joke? Uh, not for me. A grateful heart is a magnet for miracles. <gasps> Believe in that, guys. Sidetracked for a second. Look at these two set oven mitts. They say friends on them. If you, what, what? I'm beside myself. Five dollars, I love that. Oh, cool, I always need one of these. Well, <laughs> do I always need it? No. Hey, I have a whisk like that. It recently broke because 
Uh, again, I don't know my own strength. It's a problem. Ooh, butter holder. It's pretty. Oh, I do need some kitchen shears. What am I doing here? Oh my gosh, they're on sale. I'm getting them. I feel like if I don't look at the clearance now, some, like, look, he's getting everything I want. Like, look at this elephant painting. 20 bucks. That's not a deal. That's a steal. Also, that little cork board for your office or something. This one is 16. <laughs> I like this stuff. Okay. Well, all right. I'm not getting any of it. Ooh, some clearance Tupperware. Okay, here we <gasps> here we go. Too bad it's broken. I would totally take this home, but it's broke. Who's gonna buy this? It's broken. I guess if you have the know-how. Let me try to fix it, actually. You know what it needs? Super glue. That's it. That's all it needs. Perfectly functioning. I'm never gonna super glue it together. Okay, back to this stuff. So uh, last year, I feel like I saw this little uh, stand and I didn't buy it and I regretted it. Guess that price, $10. And I feel like I'm not gonna get it again this year, but it is super cute. I just, I'm not that good at decorating, so I'm gonna leave it. Ooh, look at those marshmallows though. I like the XOXO sign. Kind of reminds me of Gossip Girl. And then back there, hugs and kisses, cute count some more candles oh you guys the gnomes you know what mm, that one smells good we haven't seen a lot of gnomes i feel i mean i have a valentine's day gnome so i don't need one but you know for your sake oh yeah this is one of my favorite songs all because two people fell in love one of the greatest country songs of all time oh my word that's the cutest i love you mm doesn't smell that great. They do have these fake candy hearts. Love you, be mine. So much love, 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 love. This is us, that frame back there, if you can see it. What else? I think we've seen all of these things. Oh, Ray Dunn sign. Cool, okay, good, good stuff. Now that's a cute nighty, that shirt. And then they have some like sock slippers. Oh, here they are. Found all the hunks. They're definitely hunk of chunks. You guys, okay, birthday cake tastes like a lot like coconut, and they all kind of taste like uh, like cookie dough batter. Love them. Oatmeal chocolate chip, classic. You get them at uh, Costco for way less money. Oatmeal white chip, delicious. They also have like a cranberry white chip, the best. Oh, look, I can peek on this peanut butter chocolate, also very good. Okay, a jump rope. This works out every muscle in your body for $5. I feel like I should get one of those, but I also feel like I'll never use it. <laughs> I found some candy over here. Wait, all I have to do is scratch to find my Valentine? Oh, that's pretty fun. Gummies, jelly hearts. Have you guys noticed my knees have not cracked? I mean, I've noticed. You're probably like, Kim, we don't care. Oh my gosh, have you seen that meme? It's like, and the chestnuts on the fireplace, pop, pop, pop. However that song goes. And it's like, sorry, those are my, that's my knees popping. <laughs> I think we need a close up on this table runner because it's got like that beading detail, like your grandma made it. I love that so much. I don't know why I'm suddenly obsessed with all this Florida decor, but I'm looking at this and I live in Tampa. So you can see what everyone is known for, like Orlando, Walt Disney, Tampa, Wildcat Rescue. <laughs> like that's our claim to fame now. What else have we got? <clears throat> Oh, ooh, Everglades down there. Yep, 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 yep. Wait, where's Key West? Wow, wow, wow. Okay, so we have found some more Valentine's decor. Let's dive in. Ooh, love this. Hello, darling of mine. So cute. $7. Also, this one that says love you. The glittery wreath back there. Love frame. What's this, a little caddy? Ooh, Lazy Susan caddy. Oh my gosh, a garbage can. Also, these are really sweet as well. Guess that price, we have no idea. Oh, they're shelves. Ooh, cool. We've got some beauty, some more frames back there. Jewelry boxes, ooh, I like that little succulent holder. Oh, a candle accessory as well. I just blow it out with my breath. I used to have a candle snuffer before I had kids and then it all went downhill. I like this one, pink outline, and then the wooden middle frame. I really like, oh, it's only $6. Okay, I see the be kind peeking through. You see it back there? 
see some more frames. Oh my gosh, wait, are, is this a candle? Lord almighty, it's huge. Oh, it says love. Just pulled these roses out from behind. It's pretty much the only roses I can keep alive. Actually, I do have a rose bush. I talked to you guys about it. We hired one of our neighbors to come help us landscape, put mulch down and stuff, and pick the weeds. And we plucked our rose bush. It was so sad. Guess that. Of course, it's thirteen dollars. Of course, and I might get this. And then all of these goodies up here. Super cute. Kind of. Did you know that these were a thing? These Ray Dunn air fresheners? I had no idea. They have love. They're $5, so a little steep. You do get three. I just don't know how long they last. Uh, the cotton one smells really good. I always love looking at the frames and the sayings make today amazing. Again, with the positive affirmations. This is another gem. I've also been seeing a lot of like home decor, organizational items, lots of furniture items. Ooh, the chairs. It is a welcome to change. Look at this table. I think this is a pretty popular. Oh, 150. Ugh, not for me. That plant is pretty nice for, I'm gonna guess 70. Ooh, 60, steel. Couple more items. Ooh, look at that bench and shelf. That would be great for your um, like front door. Shoe station is what I'm thinking of. The color of that chair is lovely. That plant is nice, it's 35. Oh wait, is that a fiddle fig in the back there? Okay, this one is 80, so I guess it matters what kind of fake plant it is. <laughs> uh, all right, ooh, that's a nice shelf for the bath. I'm going to Ikea soon, so I'm hoping to find uh, some things I need there for organizational. Ooh, also this nice shelf. That's a nice one too over there. Uh, they always have a ton of baskets. I feel like I need teeny tiny little baskets like this. Oh, decent price, $7. And they're very sturdy, unlike the ones uh, you'll find at like the Dollar Tree and stuff. Hmm, okay, lamps. Are you into it? Classic. They have some nice Valentine's Day themed uh, hand. What is this called? Hand soap. I feel like that's a nice way, uh, like, to decorate your bathroom, uh, you know, a useful, something useful. Well, I guess I need to bid Marshall's farewell too. I did grab a couple of things. Ooh, dang, it's bright. So I'm home now, it's actually the next day. I'm gonna share with you everything that I got. I thought you would be interested going through this whole journey with me. Oh, and can I say, I've edited the shop with me and there are so many things that I was looking at when I was editing and I was like, that's so cute, you should have got that. So even I am jealous of myself going shopping yesterday. I mean, oh, there's a wasp out there, man. Uh-oh. Anyway, when I'm filming, I'm distracted by filming, which is probably a good thing. Otherwise, I would buy way too many things. Anyway, so I will show you everything that I did get. So here we are, start off with this one, a cardigan, you guys. Last time I really struck out at all of the thrift stores that I went to. Uh, my white cardigan, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that there was a huge gaping hole in it. This one has pockets, it's so nice. It was on clearance, but you guys know how TJ Maxx does their crappy clearance. I guess $5 off is better than no dollars off. It was still $20, but I figured it was a decent price. And it's lightweight. I'm justifying everything because I love it and I'm glad that I found it. $20 is a little steep though. I did find this apron for $8 and I don't know, it's just like a neutral kind of apron. I almost got a beige one that had like a faux leather detail going on. I don't know, I still kind of regret not getting that one, but I thought, you know, I don't know what I thought. I don't know, I, I just wanted an apron, I guess. <laughs> you know what else I've been wanting for literally years? Um, I got these two uh, tank tops for $14. I love this color, and also I've been wanting a black one for eons because I have a lot of yoga pants and workout pants that are colored that I always am trying to find like a neutral tank top that I don't really have. So, um, But Target sells a tank top, with just one for like 15 bucks, so I'm happy that I found this duo for $15. So there's that. I also got a medley of washcloths because we seem to go through them like crazy, and ooh, six dollars dollars, uh, but there's a lot in here, so there's the justification for that. I also ended up getting this cute little shirt. It was on clearance, but I think it was still 10 bucks. 
yeah, normally 13. I got it for 10. I just loved the print. There was another one that I loved as well. It was exactly the same shirt, but a different print. And I think this one just went better with me. I don't know. <laughs> I also grabbed a Valentine's Day card for Alex. He all, every night at dinner, he finds a creative way to like, he pantomimes like, hey girls, guess what? You know, I'm pantomiming and they'll say, you know, a home run or whatever. So he calls my dinners every night a home run. So I thought that was the perfect Valentine's Day card for him. I also ended up getting this. I blacked out in the uh, whatever section this is, the food prep container section. And I, I have so many gems. First of all, that was when my braid fell out and I had to find a scrunchie in my purse, the bottom pits of my purse. How much was this? I'm trying to look for the, oh, it's on top. Uh, okay, so this was $7. And it's just like a medium. For me, I think it's more like a small. But if I have blueberries or something, I think it would fit perfectly in here. Oh my gosh, another gem item is this. So this was a checkout item, an impulse purchase, if you will. And I do like the print. It's just like a red, pinky, white kind of thing. But what got me is this, the little strap up here. I love these. I don't know why they don't make more of these because Meredith, all of my kitchen towels end up on the floor every time she's in the kitchen with me, which is fine, whatever. But I would prefer that not to happen. So I wish they made more like this. I know old school, they used to make them all the time. So I found this and I thought this is absolutely perfect. My only gripe with it is I wish both of them had this. You know what I mean? Anyway, how much was this crap? Ugh, $8 for two towel, whatever. I'm gonna have them for the rest of my life, hopefully. And another thing I love is that they're not like white, so they're not gonna get really stained and dirty because that's what happens in my house. I also picked up two of these like leftover containers. I thought they were a pretty good size and it took a really long time for me to figure out the label. Does that say I can put it in the oven? I'm pretty sure that's what it says. Freezer safe, oven safe, microwave safe, dishwasher safe. I couldn't figure out in the store if that icon was an oven or a dishwasher. So I don't know, hopefully it's an oven. And you know what, even if it's not, oh, how much were these, $5? I think the oval ones were a dollar cheaper, but um, I just like the ability for these to stack and then also not take up extra space, you know what I mean? Okay, on to another section of goodies over here. I did end up getting this, which I think is absolutely adorable. I mean, whenever it's cockeyed right now. And part of me still, is that blurry? And part of me still wants to pull out all my Valentine's Day decor because I don't really remember what I got last year. It's been a whole year, but I thought this was really pretty. I don't think I have any fake roses. Is this a thing? Do people like fake flowers? I don't know. I thought it was cute. I liked the vase and all that good stuff. Oh my gosh, spent an arm and a leg on this piece of crap. I think this was by the checkout as well. $6 for hand soap? What on earth was I thinking? You know what I was thinking? Oh yeah, that's cute. <laughs> Kim, come on. Anyway, I hope this lasts a while. Maybe I'll put it in my bathroom and it'll last a lot longer. I did end up getting the kitchen shears. I don't really love the color, but they were on sale $4.50. Whatever, I got them. And they're KitchenAid, so hopefully they're, they're good quality. And then I ended up getting a few masks for the kids. Avelina, there had a few uh, in her style. And I text Alex, and these are the ones that she picked out. These are the ones that Eleanor picked out. I love the top one. It has a look like a cat nose. That's so stinking cute. But what she really liked was obviously the unicorns down there. And then for Wentworth, I got him a three-piece Spider-Man mask. Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Oh, and these were also clearance, six dollars. Uh, they were like Christmas clearance. I don't think these were on clearance. No, but these were six as well. And then these were, I think, more. Yeah, eight. Ugh, why? So that is it. Thank you guys so much for shopping around with me. If you can see, guys, I have another mountain of packages from you guys. My heart is so full. Thank you guys so much for sending me gifts. I like, I have so many Christmas cards to go through as well. I appreciate them so much. I really, really do. I don't know if I'm going to film another video. That's why I've put off, um, you know, opening them up. I think I will. I don't know when I, so just know that I feel your love. I appreciate it so much. I just want to put in the appropriate time and care to open them and appreciate it. Do you know what I mean? I don't want to just 
just like open it in my haste of chaos life and then, you know, push it to the side. I want to, you know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, it's nothing to do with this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and shopping with me and hanging out, viewing my haul and all that good stuff. If you want to subscribe, put a little happy in your day and I will see you next time. Maybe we'll go to Ikea. And the Dollar Tree has a lot of Valentine's Day stuff out. Cute stuff too. So many places to shop. Bye. I also want to go thrifting. <laughs> Somebody stop me.